Get ready for the global reset. The next two to four years is going to be very rocky for a lot of people. And I'm about to explain why. If you remember before the pandemic, I was making recession talk videos. And one of the reasons that so many businesses have closed is because the economy was very fragile to begin with. So what we're about to see is a big shift in downward mobility. There are people right now who own homes. They're going to become renters in the future. There are people who are making good money, who are doing well. They're going to start to suffer in the future. The global reset is a big shuffling of the global economy. This is going to touch every country, every economy, and many, many people who are not prepared for the global reset. Right now, real estate is white hot. If you have a house for sale, you, you could literally, between $250,000, $350,000, you could be in a bidding war for those houses because people are snatching them up right now. The stock market is going crazy and Bitcoin is going crazy. This can only go on for so long before it all falls. Here's one of the reasons it's all gonna fall. There are no real marketplace fundamentals entering into these escalating prices. Right now, go to CoreLogic. Right now, we have the highest level of mortgage delinquencies in 20 years. Does the marketplace reflect that? No. Right now, those people who are suffering mortgage delinquencies are protected. And this messes up the market because if real marketplace forces were in play, then real estate prices would not be as high as they are. So right now, we have artificial protection for people in real estate, and this is why real estate price is so high. At some point, this is going to disappear. It's going to stop and the real marketplace dynamics are going to come in. The stock market has been propped up by the Fed. The Fed's been doing monkey back, double back flips all over the stock market, keeping the stock market up, the uh, repo, printing of money, all this stuff is going on. So this is artificially propping up the stock market. Bitcoin, right now, people are desperate. People are scared and they're putting their money into Bitcoin, which is driving up the price. Real estate, stock market, and Bitcoin are all going to crash at some point in the future. Because once real marketplace fundamentals start to filter into these assets, they're going to show their true price. Because right now, real estate is overpriced. And there are many people who are locked out of the real estate market. Even if you have good credit, even if you have a halfway decent job, you still can't afford to buy a house because you're locked out. So during this global reset, and here's another part of the global reset that no one talks about. During this pandemic, we had millions and millions of businesses permanently closed. That right there is huge. During the Great Depression, we didn't have that many businesses closed. We had more businesses permanently closed between March and now than we did during the 10 years of the Great Depression. That is fundamentally resetting the global economy because it just didn't happen here. It happened in China. It happened in Europe. It happened in Germany. It's happened in Russia. What I feel is going to happen, because remember those recession talk videos that I was talking to you guys before all this happened, because the economy was very, very fragile. I feel that this global reset that is about to occur as well, it's in motion, it's happening right now, is going to separate the warriors from the farmers. And what do I mean by that? Warriors go to war, they kill things, they, they eat what they kill. Farmers till and groom stuff. If you are a farmer that's not with a lot of land, without a lot of seeds, without a lot of assets, you're gonna perish. If you're a warrior and you don't know how to hunt, you don't know how to kill, you're gonna perish. Essentially, what we're gonna have is Darwin's law, survival of the fittest. Because the weak who are being protected right now will not be protected in the future. And one of the things, and I know y'all love when I go to here, but let's call this the sugar baby index factor. Today I logged on, I literally saw 300 brand new chicks largest increase I've ever seen on the site ever. The more women that come on there, and I'm talking to these women, and they have some really tragic stories. 
They're going through a lot of stuff. And this is indicative of the economy because single mothers are going to be the harshest group of people in this new reset that's going to be punished. What's some single mother? A single mother is someone that's responsible for one, two, three, four, five, two, or however many children. And these women are barely hanging on. And this is going to be devastating because they're gonna need schools, they're gonna need daycare. They're going to be really raised. And one of the things that you're going to start to see is because of the pain and the anguish that these single mothers are going through, that a lot of women are gonna make the decision not to have children unless they're married. You're gonna see this, this is gonna come. No one's talking about this because women are just popping out kids left and right, but it's gonna be so hard, it's gonna be so enduring, that a lot of women are gonna be like, I ain't gonna do that. And then they get pregnant, they're gonna have abortion. They're not, they're just not gonna do it. Because during this global reset, I want you to think of natural forest fire. If you don't know, a natural forest fire is when lightning strikes a fire and it burns off a lot of this old foliage. When trees grow so big and tall and thick that no sunlight can get to the ground. So a lot of stuff doesn't grow because no sunlight gets there. But with these natural forest fires, it raises the forest and burns down these old trees so new trees can grow up. During this global reset, you're going to see, you're going to understand there's gonna be a new wave of new businesses, new titans. There are many people who are gonna become multi-millionaires during this global resets. I plan on being one of them. Being a millionaire right now, I wanna be a multi-millionaire have millions and millions of dollars cash money in the bank. One of the things that is going to happen is the people who are in proximity, the folks who are in proximity to becoming mega rich are going to get richer. Like Joe Biden, I made my video, like I'm not worried about taxes because Biden can't touch me, you know, the way I run my business. And what you're going to see is an emergence of a super class. They're going to be like Jeff Bezos, he's a member of the super class. He's the richest man on the planet, and he actually could be on track to become the world's first trillionaire. This is going to be the emergence of the new super class. These are people who are going to have so much money that they can have their own armies. They can have their own countries. They're going to have their own islands. They're going to have their own air forces. They're going to have all of their own personal things that you could barely even dream about. They will have of private jet. They will have a fleet of private jets. They will have armed security. They will have armies. They will have missionaries. You, this is one of the things that you will see in some third world countries now for the people with the money. They already have this. It's just going to be a new super class of people. What about the average working man? Hear me and hear me well. If you're the average working man, you're about to get messed over because one of the things that's going to happen during this global reset is corporations are going to be looking to do more with less and because of automation and technology they can you might be in a sweet spot right now but it's not going to be like that in the future these corporations are going to start getting rid of people in mass and this is going to swell the unemployment rolls this is going to make it really hard because my dudes, let me talk to you. If you got your own place, you got your own car, you have minimum debt to no debt, you will be a winner in this new economy because there will be so many people who will be suffering, who won't have anything, who will literally be begging for $50. So if you are a stable, well-suited, well-heeled man with limited debt, with some strong cash flow, you will be king in this new economy. And now I'm just talking to the regular dude that's got his stuff together, that doesn't have a lot of debt, that is going to be able to mac out like macking has never been mac before. Because one of the things that you're gonna see is the emergence of families. You're gonna see generations living, families living together. You're gonna see two and three and four generations living together. It's gonna be big mama, it's going to be the son, it's going to be the wife, it's going to be the children. You're going to see this happen and it's going to be all over it's the Waltons. The Waltons will be all over the place. When I was a kid, there was a show called The Waltons. It was John Boy. It was their grandfather. It was their father. It was John Boy. 
and some other people all in this one big house. You're gonna see a, a big return to that because families who work together will be able to get through the global reset. They will share resources, they will work together, they would put beans and rice in the pot and cook it up for everybody and cook some cornbread. These folks will be able to weather this global reset. If you are a lone ranger, if you don't have family or assets or money, you could be in trouble. This is why I know my MGTOW and Red Pill men, a lot of people about to get married. This is going to push so many people to get married and form families and build because it's going to be so tough out there. We're going to have a return to the 1920s, 1930s, 1940s, and 1950s where people had to get married. They're going to have to get married to make, to survive this. And the wise people are going to start pairing up as quick as they possible. And they're going to start doing the right things with their money and putting their stuff together so they can survive this global reset. This global reset is going to be brutal. It's going to redefine industries. It's going to redefine education. It's going to redefine the workplace. And this, the next, let's say next two to five years, we're going to see some things we've never seen before in our society. Like take what happened with the last election. What put Joe Biden in the office of the presidency? Mail-in voting. I sat there and I watched it state after state. Joe was flipping states like people were flipping dominoes. Flip Michigan, flip Pennsylvania, flip Georgia, flip, 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 flip because of mail-in voting. And right now, people who have been locked down and we may have a second lockdown have started to appreciate the convenience of shopping online. So these are some industries that are going to boom. E-commerce. If you want to start a business, you want to get into e-commerce, as soon as you can. E-commerce is gonna boom. Home delivery services is gonna boom. Remodeling services of homes, because people are in their homes. They're gonna start tricking out their homes. They're gonna start installing pools. They're gonna start um, remodeling, redecorating. So if you are a remodeler, you, you're gonna have more business than you can handle. Um, you're going to see a return to the nuclear family. For my corporate citizen men out here, you're going to be able to marry a woman. She's going to stay home. She's going to take care of your kids. She's going to teach your kids. She's going to be a good wife. We're going to see a return to the nuclear family. During this global reset, it is a resetting of America and the world and resetting our norms. If you feel me, this is opportunity if you are a hustler. If you are just a regular dude, just sitting around looking for the cheat code, trying to find something easy, you're going to be you're gonna get ran over it's gonna to touch everybody and also with the pandemic we're gonna be dealing with this forever the pandemic is gonna be like the flu it's gonna be around forever and it, we're gonna be dealing with this for a few years and this is gonna be a big big issue so I want you guys to understand that the things that are happening are going to be catastrophic if you're not in the state of hustling if you're not trying to build anything you're not trying to create anything you're just trying to survive, it's going to be rough for you. It's going to be rough for you. And it's going to be a big, big issue in terms of you getting your business, getting your money and growing because either you're going to be growing or you're going to be dying. There ain't going to be no middle ground. You're going to be growing or you're going to be dying. So during this global reset, you're going to see an emergence, like I said, of the super class. I mean, people who are richer than God. You're going to see all kinds of stuff. You're going to see new technological advances. You're going to see people on the Internet. You're going to see the, the conglomeration, the merging of many businesses. You're going to see so many things that's just going to make you scratch your head and go like, wow, because the global reset is on and popping. And if you don't want to be a victim of the global reset, you don't want to be a victim of downward mobility. Before the pandemic, we had 160 million people working. Of those 160 million, half made less than $33,000 a year. They're about to make less. 160 million people working, over half, like 80 million people made $33,000 a year or less. That's about to go down. And what's gonna happen is people who are highly specialized, highly skilled in tech, uh, cybersecurity, stuff like that, their, their salaries are gonna boom. They're gonna, they're gonna, cause everyone's gonna need cybersecurity because everything is moving to the internet. 
everything. Even if you have a lawn care service and you don't have an internet site and access, that's gonna hurt you. There are millennials will not do business with you if they can't book you online. They won't do business with you. And that's the largest demographic right now in the country. Everything's moving online. You're gonna to have to become well-versed. You're gonna to have to know how to do certain things. You're gonna to have to know how to work the internet to be a producer or creator of the internet, not just a mere consumer. Once again, there's gonna be opportunity for those who are willing to roll up their sleeves and go to work. There will be opportunity and there will be an opportunity for you to become rich. During all of this chaos, this big shakeup, there will be an opportunity for you to become rich. So if you wanna become rich, you wanna go ahead and get into the game, go below and enroll in the corporate toolbox. What it is, is I teach you how to set up a holding company. I teach you how to set up your operating companies. I teach you how to create a corporate structure that's tax efficient. And more importantly, I teach you how to start a business from scratch. Links below, price going up in December. I will see you guys in the next one.